Yo, what is up everybody? This is Abubanade. What? And I told you I was going to throw up a quick review, and I do mean quick. Um, there's not a lot to discuss, but what there is 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 pretty damn cool. Um, first of all, the strange, strange thing happened. I downloaded this this morning, and I swear it had sound, and now I can't get the sound to work. And I even used a, a different emulator. I tried it on two different computers and no sound. So I'll be interested to know if you guys download it, if, if you guys get sound or not. I wasn't going to do it because it didn't have sound. Um, but I thought, no, I told you guys I was going to do it, so I'll go ahead and do it. And I'll just put a beat in the background and we'll jam out. Boom! There you go. Okay, first of all, this mod is called the Empire Mod. <laughs> Created by Grand Moff Tarkin. If you don't know who that is, then you're probably not a Star Wars fan. Um, anyways, let's go ahead and get in here. Now, uh, some of the some of the things that um, was mentioned in the description were um, the fact that destroyers uh, have a range of five now and a minimum range of two. Uh, subs do more damage and when you have it maxed out like the maxed uh, veterancy they shoot missiles which is pretty badass that's something new and um, different and the heavies and the super heavies and the regular artillery have a, a range increase of one and then the rocket artilleries have a range increase of two when they reach their max veterancy I noticed that in uh, I, I don't know if it's all the shipyards or just a couple of them, but you can produce infantry units out of there. Um, what else? Some of the generals have been touched up, and there, there's definitely there's some added generals to this. You'll you'll enjoy if you're a Star Wars fan. Anyways, this is what I think is the coolest thing. I will leave the the rest of the discovery process to you as as what has changed. That's kind of what I like most about it is like playing through it and just discovering different stuff that's going on then you guys can talk about it anyways all these maps 39 through 60 are based on 1939 map and what we got going on is we have empires now 1939 is the British Empire as you can see England or the British Empire takes all of Canada its homeland it's got its colonies, the British Raj, all kinds of shit through here, Australia. So, um, and you also, and I'll show you this later, the generals have been added that uh, were in control at the times of these empires. 43, oh, and don't be freaked out on 39 if you start out and you can't attack the first round. Um, it's just that first round you can't attack. You can just like move your troops around. Anyways, 1943 is the Mongolian Empire. See, I think this shit is cool. This is like something new and refreshing. I haven't seen this before. If there's a mod out there that does this, I have not seen it. I, I don't even know how long this mod has been out for, actually. Anyways, like I said, um, pretty badass. You got the Mongolian Empire. 1950 is um, the Greek Empire. Pretty lame compared to the Mongolian and the British, right? Lame. Speed it up, bros. Come on. 1960, you got the Roman Empire. Look at that. Pretty. They got a pretty nice chunk of land there. And uh, I don't think this is anything. I just think this is like normal 1939. I better click on it before somebody says, No, bro, you're an idiot. I'm not even listed. That's weird. The flag's not even there. Um, yeah, this looks pretty... Pretty, um... 1939-ish. Anyways, on the website that, that I will give you, um, there's a vote for what the next... Oh, damn it. What the next uh, empire is going to be. I don't remember any of them right offhand. Maybe the Inca, Aztecs, uh, Egyptians? I don't, I don't, I don't remember. Anyways, let me show you the generals here. So 
So here are your generals and the one for the British Empire. Boom, there he is, your boy Nelson. Uh, I, I don't remember where these generals are at, actually. I do remember somebody saying De Gaulle was buffed. I do, I did remember seeing that. There might be some new generals, too. Besides these, these weird ones that you'll see here in a little bit. I already clicked on that. What a dumbass. There's our boy, Manstein. Those all look familiar. Um, what do we got here? Oh, is there a lot of generals here? More than usual or what? Or I don't remember there being that many generals. Anyways, uh, we're, we're looking for the other generals for the empires. Apparently... Hold on, one should have been in Rome, right? Oh yeah, there we go. Caesar. Damn, he's badass. Caesar ain't messing around. Uh, this should have uh, Genghis Khan, maybe? Nope. Somewhere should be Genghis Khan. Genghis Khan? Yep, Khan, but there's no picture. And then we've got... Alexander the Third, Alexander the Great for Greece. And then... This is, this is the funny one, the Imperial Starfleet. Check out these guys. They're all, um, like admirals from <laughs> Star Wars. Thrawn is, uh, pretty badass, actually. I think he's the only there. Yeah, he's pretty decent. Not, uh, he sucks. Ozil. Uh, whatever. This guy, I don't, I've never even heard of this guy. I don't even, I, I recognize this guy for sure. Well, I recognize all of them. Oh, this guy got ripped off. What happened to his stars? I guess the creator did not like that admiral. Anyways, bros, like I said, it's going to be quick. That is pretty much it. Oh, wow. I, I get to pick a general. Um, everything else looks to be... Yeah, all the generals are already unlocked as soon as you get some medals. Let's actually look at, um, the missions give more medals. Oh, I remember. I remember. If you do just like one of the conquests, even out of 39, say, I don't know. Where's a decent one? Poland. 10,000 medals. There you go. There's your badass generals. You already got them. Anyways, I think that's all I want to say. I will let the rest, uh, you guys discover. A discovery of what else is badass in this mod. The main thing I liked about it is, is the the like the the empires. I think that's a cool idea. In the future, they were talking about having like multiple empires on one map. I guess he's gonna make this a new empire. Whoever wins the vote. Anyways, bros, that is going to wrap it up. I hope you enjoyed this. Go out. Let me know. Remember to tell me if yours has sound or not. Because I swear mine did. Anyways, if you're enjoying this content, go ahead and slap this shit all I can subscribe. And I will see you back here for an next upload. Peace. Ruminati. Out. Ooh.